So choice architecture is an important behavioral finance concept. And basically what choice architecture deals with is the fact that every aspect of the choice environment affects the outcomes. For example, which candidate's name appears first on a voting ballot can and does impact the voting outcomes. And to show this concept of choice architecture, uh, Shlomo Bernardsi and Richard Thaler uh, did an experiment uh, related to the number of lines on an investment sign-up form and showed that it had an effect on investment choices. Uh, the, the experiment involved uh, Morningstar.com subscribers and they were presented with eight investment funds and were asked to construct a portfolio. One group was presented with an investment election form with eight lines. Another group was presented with an investment election form with four lines though selecting more than four funds was just a click away. The question uh, was uh, posed to the, um, to the uh, subscribers, uh, please indicate how you would allocate your retirement contributions. If you would like to elect more than four funds, please click here. And we can see from this slide the, the vast difference in the result that we got. For people who were uh, given eight lines to choose for, uh, to fill in the original uh, exercise, we can see the in blue the percentage that picked each number of funds. However, when we look at the, the red bars, these are the folks who were given four lines and told if you want more than four lines, just click and we'll provide you with four more lines. So we can see here the dramatic difference you get just by simply framing the question uh, differently and the input form differently. This has enormous impact on, uh, on how uh, investors uh, generally, let's say in a 401k plan, decide to make their election. <music>